Here we go, this is Hamut and Yin for our 2-3-5 uh, to five minutes of uh, giving you some tips in expanding your business. And uh, the thing we're going to talk today, Yin, is how to use a book as the best or why would a book be the best calling card, the best business card ever created. And um, so why should one have and how can one uh, uh, actually get one? Well, um Having a book uh, to your name, to your profession, I think it's uh, almost like saying that you are uh, an uh, authority in the area. You're you wrote the, the book on it. You wrote the book on it. That's, yes, that's exactly. where the phrase comes from. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, and, uh, and from young, I think we have we been um, you know, educated from school to always uh, respect books, you know, education, respect teachers. Uh, and even uh, right now, you know, um, in, 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 a, in the normal school faculty, right, a professor who does not publish any book or any write any textbook on any subject that he's uh, you know lecturing on he actually will not advance on the faculty ranking yes in fact they uh, that's where the saying comes uh, publish or bearish mm -hmm, that's right okay in, uh, now, okay so we talked however a lot how the internet and the social media and publishing videos like we do now here publishing articles on thousands and thousands of sites literally mm -hmm. um, keyboard packed with the correct titles and even the same article with different titles and uh, so anyways to be seen in the masses there mm -hmm. um, wouldn't that make a book kind of irrelevant uh, or is the book becoming less relevant uh, because no, of that? Not necessarily. I think the book will because of that be even more relevant because as you're out there in the community you show a very involved self. You, know, you, you show that you are out there with people and when if you publish a book um, compared to the old days where uh, you know, a book writer literally have to visit uh, book publishers one on one to sell the books. Now the uh, lines of selling books, the, or the ways of selling books through the internet are now numerous, tremendous uh, for, for a book author. Definitely. That brings me to a topic of, uh, so, um, so first of all, having a book in your title mm -hmm. um, is, is super important because mm -hmm. he wrote the book on it. That's right. Okay, now, you know, first of all, um, it, it, there are two ways of publishing a book. One is self-publishing and one is publishing to a publisher. That's right. Okay. And what you just said is basically you want to do self-publishing your book. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm not so sure if the public knows, the people listening to this, that the average book in America or around the world sold sells less than a few hundred books. A year? A year. Yeah. No, no, period. Mm, okay. Period. Period. Uh, they go nowhere. Mm -hmm. uh, another thing is a misconception that books in a bookstore like Barnes & Noble and stuff will make a book selling. Mm, no, they won't. No, no, not true. They won't at all. Right. Uh, because you get one or two books somewhere up there, you know, except if you're Bill Clinton or, or somebody like that, mm -hmm. yes, then you get your book, you know, you get real estate, literally prime real estate, mm -hmm. like, uh, um, otherwise it doesn't sell. Uh, but the main key is, you gotta have a, just having a book in your own office or whatever, That's having right. it, and of course, if you do it right, uh, uh, one can get tremendous amount of radio interviews with it, mm -hmm. and television. That's right. Yeah, because, um, as you probably noticed, uh, most, uh, interviews with people, even on Oprah and, and stuff like that, it's the guy has a book mm -hmm. or a movie out. That's right. You know, yeah, That's how you get on. Right. And then what he's talked about is not necessarily about the book. You can now talk about anything. Right. Um, well, we have our own example here. You, uh, you wrote a book. I wrote a book. Yes, and um, by doing so, um, we find that uh, people were, were actually, were they, 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 they read the book or they found about, about a book through some press releases that we have and they call us uh, and then say that we want to interview you. So that was actually all done before because of the book. Of course, we can be also known as an yeah. expert, but I think the book helped tremendously in that area. Yeah, never mind that the book um, um, uh, got me a, a whole tour of uh, speaking engagements uh, uh -huh. in India. That's true. Um, to hundreds and hundreds of people. Mm -hmm. uh, made me sales in the amount of uh, thousands and thousands of dollars, which is really, that, you know, here's a point. One might or might not make money with the book, mm -hmm. you know, like if you ask in the old days at least, maybe now it's different, Mr. Robert Kiyosaki, the, 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 the author of the book, Boor Dad, Rich Dad, mm -hmm. he will clearly say, how much money did you, did you make with the book? Very little, right. few thousand maybe, mm -hmm. but because of the book, m millions of dollars of seminars and consulting that's services right. have been sold. That's right. And that's the same whether you're a doctor or a car mechanic. Mm -hmm. It's the business you get because of it. 
Um, there's more data on how one can write a book without writing one yourself because believe it or not, um, I don't know what the number is, but it's a huge, it's 90 some percent, all the books on the market are ghost written, mm -hmm. not, not my one, uh, <laughs> but I do ghost writing, um, actually not myself, um, but we have, yeah, there's you know, lots, of, lots, of, lots of people out there, yeah. Um, so actually, there, where there is a will, there is a way. Um, and let me tell you something, in a time like an economy like today, you want to use every little tiny advantage to stick out. If it's not a synergy and not everything you use, somewhere along the line you're just simply losing out. The most money you lose is not the money you waste, but the money you never make. You'll never make. <laughs> all right. Um, and you will lose lots of money by not using all the tools together in synergy. Um, uh, you know, if you don't do that, that's like trying to have a, a, a body functioning well and being super healthy and only taking care of the heart, only taking care of the brain, or taking care of two or three things, but then nevertheless leaving out four, five or six other major important things. All right? Good. Well, let our audience uh, go to our resources and uh, check out more on the book, uh, How to Become a Best-Selling Author. Yeah, and check it out and check out other resources about uh, this whole thing too. There's lots of it on the internet. Um, which you can find out how you can actually become an author and yes, a best selling author within mm -hmm. three to five months after having published your book if that's what you want. Alright, mm -hmm. let's go for it. Ciao, ciao. Bye.